Today, while running Visual Studio Code with Flutter, I was trying to run the simulator from Xcode, and I got an error message that said OS 18.1 was not installed. I tried to install it using the obvious methods of get, etc., and it didn't work. So here's how I solved it in a few minutes. I pressed Command Spacebar, and then typed in Xcode to launch Xcode. And when Xcode came up, although it's not intuitive, just select Create a New Project. And right there, we'll see there's multi-platform iOS, and it says 18.1 is not installed. It, the app is triggered. We can go ahead and click Get. But if you look at Document, Game, Augmented, it's all saying 18.1 is not installed for Xcode Simulator. Mac OS, there's no such message. On the Watch OS, it says OS 11.1 is not installed. And then on the others, there are other versions that may not be installed. But we're focused on the iOS app. So right here, we'll click Get. And this is going to take a couple of minutes to download. It's 8.58 gig, and I don't have the fastest connection. So we'll fast forward through this. And here we're approaching the final leg. We're at 8.03 gig of 8.59. And now it's installing and registering the download. And it says Xcode notifications may include. I'll let that happen. Let's select options and say allow. And then the IO8 uh, simulator has been downloaded, and here we're verifying the sim runtime. This also takes a few minutes, so we'll speed it up just a little. And that appears to be done. So let's just look at the tabs again. So iOS. The error message is no longer there. The simulator is downloaded, but we've already run it, so we're good to go. Looking at Mac OS, no error message. All the others are still not installed. We've only fixed the 18.1 for iOS. tbOS is not installed. So let's exit this, see whether the application actually works. So pressing Command, Spacebar, and we've launched Visual Studio Code. And there's an app that we created, a basic standard app. First, we'll run it without the simulator, just to make sure the application works. And there it is, that's what it looks like on Mac OS. And now, let's run it with the simulator by clicking the simulator and activating the iPhone 15 Pro. It says iOS 18.0, uh, but the error message doesn't pop up. So if we run this, Flutter launches on the bottom right. And then we see the application kick in. So even though the iPhone 15 Pro says it's iOS 18.0, we're not getting the 18.1 error message, and that's all there is to it. Run Xcode, launch a new project, click on the download you want, get it, install it, and then apply it. I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.